Oh, are we beading a bit, Brad? Yeah, I'll give it you. Oh, I'm not sure you need the bad bits of the paint, obviously. Yeah, it's better open it as well. Oh, oh yeah, it's the end of an evening, so I might have changed my setting so it gets a little bit brighter. Um, but we're just going to do a really fast video because I've been very busy with the house all week. Uh, and now I've got Harrison on the weekend. He has been coming down the house with me as well so I can continue working on it. Um, I'm just going to do a little update for you guys um, on sort of what's happening. What sort of stuff I've bought for my car and where we're going to go from there. So the sun is going down very fast so we're just going to try and shoot through this. Like I said, it's just going to be really kind of an update but I'm going to run through sort of uh, the things I've bought for my car. And sort of, yeah. Everything. So, first of all, and mainly, um, what well, hopefully you're all going to be a little bit more pleased about, um, especially Greg, who keeps commenting on my Instagram all the time. Um, I've bought a blank for my uh, rear windscreen wiper and the silicone that's come with it. I've got this from D Wiper uh, on eBay, um, and I will be putting that in my next video and I can explain about it a little bit more. Um, rather than the killer wipers, I did go with a D Wiper on eBay in the end because it was a little bit cheaper and I just want to try them out. And if it is any decent, you guys can save yourself some money as well because it is about half price, which is banging. And if it looks all good, hopefully that'll be good. <laughs> so yeah, D wiper kit first of all. Secondly, um, when I did the sort of headlight upgrade and I changed the sort of bulbs to make sure they were, yeah, better. Um, we have now gone with the indicator lights. These ones are obviously clear looking but do still give the orange light, um, but they're not those massive, ugly orange lights that are in the front of the headlights. So we've got some nice clear ones to swap in. Like I said, I'm not gonna do that just yet because I think it's gonna might be a bit of a pain in the ass, but um, we will see someone when I'm gonna get that one done. Um, went to JMRS the other day. I cannot find where I got my little, but I got some more um, handles for the inside of the car. I bought another set just so I can faff with them, see if I can um, get the handle out and spray it, either black or red. I think I'll go black with the first one, see what it looks like when I get them in, and I might spray this set after swapping them out um, red, just so I can spice it up a little bit and see which one I prefer. Um, but like I said, I didn't want the handle silver, so I bought an extra set um, to faff with, because they're only cheap, um, so I'm gonna see if I can pull them apart, um, sand them down and spray them a color that is better than silver, and it will match hopefully the inside of the car better. While I was there, I got some stickers as well, black and red, thank you James. These are gonna be going on the side of my car instead of those silver Renault Sport ones um, along the little side splitter there. We're gonna have black and red, which will go with the car theme that I will eventually bring along. These, I don't quite know why I bought these yet, um, but we will use them someday, hopefully. Uh, but these are air ducts for my fog lights, because I don't want my fog lights anymore, because I never use my fog lights anyway, um, because it is a orange bulb in there. I probably could just change the bulb to a white bulb, but instead I want to go with air ducts. I don't know what kind of piping I need to get off the back of this or, or anything, to be quite honest with you, but we've got some air ducts, because so I think they look badass on the front. But like I said, another thing to buy before we just put these in, otherwise it will just be a hole. Um, but yeah, we are prepared, let's say, but I don't know how long it will be until they get anywhere near. Uh, at the front of the car but hopefully we'll make it look a little bit more sort of mean at the front let's say and lastly how do you open it yet yeah we have aaron put me in this direction so i know you always want the video so cheers <laughs> but we've got our sun strip so i just want this black sun strip obviously to make it look a little bit more mean at the front i think it looks like make the car a little bit better i am considering buying the renault sport sticker to go on top of it as well and um, i just want to fit this first of all um, and see if i like it or not pretty much before buying the sticker as well so i'm gonna i'm gonna have this i'm gonna fit it see if i like it and i might buy like a gloss black um, or a red renault sport sticker to go on top of the car as well to like i said when i get the theme going a red and black um it might work a little bit better than the red or than the black on black, but then again, the black on black might look nice and stealthy. So if that didn't confuse you enough, I've got a sun strip. Going to try it out um, eventually when I get the time to stick them on. Um, so yeah, that is it really. Like I said, the main one I will be hopefully doing by next weekend's video um, will be that D wiper kit. Once again, if you guys are interested, if you look on eBay, um, these are going for six pounds at the moment. Don't know how long they're gonna stay down at that for. I'm gonna try and fit this as best as I can. It comes with a little guide as well. Um, so I'm gonna be going, hopefully going through the guide nice and easy. You can also buy the silicone on there as well. I just did that to make it nice and easy for myself. Um, but I, I think it's going for about three or four pounds. So you just gonna check that out. It's pretty much just typing clear D wiper. This one comes up for six quid at the moment. Um, and then you also can get the silicone as well to come with it like I did. Um, but yeah, I'll be fitting that next weekend. 
any questions about what coming up, what do you think I should do, things like that, whether buying uh, the air ducts for the fog lights was a good idea or not, well, I don't know, but we'll find it out. Um, but yeah, just a few stickers and a few little small changes for now. Like I said, I have made a big purchase of my house recently, if you haven't made, uh, if you haven't still seen the video, um, and uh, pretty much all my money is going into new windows, new doors, fixing the boiler, etc, etc, etc. So there's a lot of money going into the house and not a lot into the Clio, but eventually we'll get to it. Um, and we're almost at a thousand subscribers as well. Um, so we'll uh, see if I can do something for you guys then. But yeah, it's a big milestone. I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with how we've gone. I'm, like I said, it's all sort of just been me doing videos really. It's taken a while. It's taken, I think I've been doing videos now for almost two years. So it's been quite a while I've been doing this. Um, but like I said, they're only very generic videos. But hopefully in the long run, I can have one sort of clear as sort of my, uh, as a daily, but like a nice, clean car unlike this one that's a little bit bad and bruised love you really um but this one i want to turn into more of a track car eventually so i can have this one for track days and just have one for a sort of casual driving for the channel and things like that i also do really like the look of the rs 200s in the next level up but then everybody says don't do it so it might be two 182s a nice clean one and a nice one for track um but yeah we'll see how we go See what you guys think. Comment down below. Like and subscribe as always. Thank you for tuning in uh, and I'll see you next week.